Hello folks, Phil Gallagher here for sort of an end of July, beginning of August uh, channel update. Um, first thing I want to do is kind of explain what I've uh, vaguely put, talked about for the last bit of videos. Um, my mother passed away unexpectedly while while camping, you know, went, went to bed, didn't wake up, that sort of thing. Um, I am in an okay place mentally. Um, thank you in advance for the comments that you're going to leave. I, I do appreciate it. I do read them. Um, I have just been very busy. It's It's been one of those things where for the past week and a half, I've been working 12 plus hour days to just kind of go and take care of everything that needed to get taken care of. So I'm good. I am just very physically tired and worn down. Um, so accordingly, I'm going to be taking a little bit of a break from recording videos in order to sort of like mentally uh, sort of rest up and like make sure I'm good for the, the start of the, the school year. So again, I am, I, I have grieved. I'm, I'm good mentally, but I'm, I'm just physically worn out. Uh, there was, there was a lot of, of cleaning, bagging things up for goodwill, that, that sort of stuff. A, a whopping eight tube TVs that were carried out of my basement. <sighs> so, um, but I am, uh, I am, I am okay. And most of the things that have been done need to be, most of the things that need to be done have been done. Um, but I, I just need a week to kind of like get my head around all the things that I need to be doing, relax a little bit and take care of the stuff that I've put off for the last two weeks before school gets started. Okay, um, moving on, um, I don't know exactly when my content will come back. I am going to take a one-week break from recording, and then once I have recorded five videos, I will start putting them up again. So it may be a week and a half at the absolute outside edge, two weeks before my next video goes up. I don't know exactly when it will be. There is a little bell-shaped icon um, below a YouTube video. If you click that, you will turn on notifications for my channel, and you will get a little uh, push update via YouTube up in the top uh, the next time I release a video. If you're worried about missing my next video, uh, feel free to do that. Um, okay, when my content returns, it is going to be returning to five-day-a-week content. I, I loved being a full-time content creator this summer. It, it was so much fun. It was such a rewarding experience. I learned so much. My content improved so much. Um, and I, I love the the community that I'm growing. Like, it, it's awesome that for so many people, I am the thing you, you watch over lunch or before you go to bed. And I know that there's, like, a good amount of comfort in, in that sort of regular, steady thing. Uh, you know, for me, I, you know, uh, every day I, wa I watch Jorbs, a Slay the Spire streamer, before I, I go to bed, and that's just part of my routine, and I'm so happy that I'm part of a routine for so many of you. You know, that, that gives me the, the warm and fuzzies all over. Okay, um, I think, I think I can support five-day-a-week content while working. I, I don't think I can do that if I'm streaming, but I think with the YouTube videos it'll be okay. The... The biggest limiting factor is probably the processing time. Uh, you know, after, after, all right, inside baseball for a second. After I record a video, I, I process it twice. Once to take out the dead air and a second time to kind of staple everything together. So there, there might be between two and four hours of time where the video is just kind of processing in the background. And as long as I physically have time to get all those videos started and I get into an okay routine with that, I think I can keep up video content five days a week. I hope you enjoyed the seven days a week over the summer. That'll probably return next summer, um, but it's just not something that I can sustain while working full time. You know, the hopefully, hopefully the pandemic is winding down a little bit and we're going to get a nice return to, to normalcy. Um, but with that return to normalcy, you know, that means I'm not going to be working uh, from home anymore. I'm not just going to be sitting around all the time. I'm going to be going to paper magic events sometime, you know, in the, in the next year. Um, so there will be other things to think about. Okay, uh, some technical stuff for a second here. I have learned that YouTube automatically changes the volume of my videos when I upload them. So when I listen to the videos on my end, on my computer, like the audio is crisp and perfect and exactly at the volume that I want it. And then YouTube does a dampening effect on it. 
and that's why my videos appear so quiet to many of you. So I am aware of the issue uh, when I have time to research it and dig in and figure out like exactly what volume levels things need to be at. I'll work with that. Uh, I've had a couple of experiments recently where I've messed with the gain in an attempt to uh, like bump my volume up uh, and that didn't quite work out. I'm, I'm figuring that out. Um, that will be one of those things that will be fixed in the future. I don't know when, but now that I know what the problem is, I can research fixing it. Uh, okay, um, next up I got some complaints about guest audio balance. I am aware of the issue. In the future, I am going to try to only have guests that have uh, better microphone setups. Um, so while my content with Lincoln was awesome, he was really quiet. And I got a couple of complaints about like, yeah, I cranked up the volume and then I got absolutely destroyed by ads. So my bad on that. Again, it sounded pretty good on my end, but the YouTube dampening thing uh, is even worse with the guest content when we have two different volume levels. Um, so those are things that I'm going to be working on. Um, one thing to be aware of for this month in particular is that the donation queue is probably going to be a little bit thick. Oops, my website is briefly offline for scheduled maintenance. Okay, I'm not going to show that off visually then. Um, I have maybe two, two and a half weeks worth of uh, donation deck lists already in the queue. And if I take a week off from recording, that'll probably build up a little bit. So expect a little bit of a longer wait time than normal uh, for your donation deck list to happen. Um, I think that's all I have to say in this channel update video. Um, the last thing I'll say here is that, you know, if you're a regular watcher of my content and, you know, you're kind of sad about the next week, just remember, you probably haven't watched everything, unless you're one of the super fans. You, you, you know who you are. Um, feel free to dive back through some of the older stuff, and I hope you enjoy it. Um, I didn't do a lot of advertising for the last week or so. If you haven't watched the Shamans video in particular, I really recommend that one. That was a lot of fun for me. All right, um, have a great rest of the day, folks, and I'll see you again in a week or so.